I, I think the, the three of the things that set this field apart um, from other fields in general, um, obviously the setting, um, where we're located, Uptown Charlotte, Center City here. Um, this was a long time coming uh, for the city of Charlotte, this ballpark, and it has become a crown jewel of Uptown. So the award and the recognition um, is a way to show that the hard work paid off, but it's really more of a testament to um, the hours, uh, the work that, that our crew does, in particular, my full-time assistant, uh, who's on staff, and it, it's a true testament to the support that we get from our front office here in Charlotte. Dirt is often overlooked, I feel like, especially from the people who are sitting in the stands. 70% um, of the game takes place on dirt. Um, that's where you kind of, that's where you make your name for yourself in this business, is from how you maintain your dirt. Uh, there's rarely a week that goes by during the season that I don't see Rick. Rick is, uh, he has a strong turf background. He was a golf course superintendent uh, prior, to, prior to joining Greenville Turf and Tractor. So, you know, the thing that's great is when Rick comes out, he's, a, he's actually an extra set of turf eyes. I think we have a great customer vendor relationship with Matt. Uh, Matt has, uh, Matt's able to, you know, pretty much communicate his, um, his issues, his concerns to us in a uh, direct manner which allows us to be able to be able to make sure that we're on time with uh, helping him and getting, getting the right kind of help. 1200 A is probably actually my favorite piece of equipment that we brought in. It, from, a, from a baseball standpoint, it is, it, it's just, it's phenomenal. It's a simple machine. It, uh, the turning radius on it is outstanding. You can turn it on a dime. So the 7200A um, is our it is our staple point in our fleet uh, from a mowing standpoint. As I said, it, it's a it's a new setup to me. Um, I've been super impressed with it. The quality of cut uh, is second to none. In this industry, you have to have passion for what you do. If you don't, you're not going to make it. Matt has so much passion for the product that we put out day in and day out. It makes me want to be, you know, makes me want to do better. Makes me want to work harder. I hate saying my staff because um, I think we are a team. Uh, our team here, they truly enjoy what they do. and. They're, they're willing to put forth the hours, they're willing to, uh, anything that we need, any, any weather situation. Um, that group of um, men and women are what makes this place go round.